Good morning, Vox. Today is March 3rd, and I'm Parker Ryan. On today's show, we have news on Florida's large number of COVID variants, the current situation in Texas, and a Disney Plus review. But first, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Currently, Florida is leading the nation with a stunning 434 COVID-19 variant. Many of these mutations are deadlier than the original coronavirus. It is important to continue social distancing and to wear a mask to keep down the spread of these new variants. Another dire situation is still unfolding in Texas. Over the past couple of weeks, due to a disastrous snowstorm, power grids all across the state failed and millions of Texans were without power. As power was beginning to be restored, many Texans discovered that their tap water had run dry, their pipes had burst, and water treatment plants across the state had failed, leaving many forced to boil their water so that it was drinkable. Most people now have their power back on, but are being hit with outrageous electrical, electrical bills. Turning back to local news, here's Noah Bryant with a review on the best movies in Palm Beach County. There are many options in Palm Beach County for quality smoothies, and today I'm going to be reviewing two of the top five places in Jupiter, Florida. According to Three Natives, they only use the freshest acai berries shipped overnight from their sustainable producer in Brazil. They cold press their berries into an atrocious juice and serve them as the ingredient for a chopped bowl. Three Natives also source all of their fruit and vegetables from local organic producers. For Tropical Smoothie, it all started on a beach in Florida. Kids were needing a replenishment from the hot sun, so Tropical Smoothies started blending fruits and vegetables to create unique and refreshing smoothies. Soon enough, there was a line out the door for a smoothie away from the sun. Both Tropical Smoothie and Three Natives have delicious drinks, but all in all, in my opinion, Three Natives had a better tasting, healthier, and organic smoothie. Let us know your favorite place to go for smoothies on Ednota. Now back to Parker in the studio. Thanks, Noah. Those both look good. In school news, the yearbook deadline to get your school picture submitted is this week. The link for virtual students to take a selfie and send it in for the yearbook is shown on screen and is located on our Admodo page. There you will enter your student ID and take a picture following the directions provided, as well as the box student code of conduct. All photos must adhere to the school dress code. The deadline has been extended to Friday, March 5th. As you plan your weekend, here's Valerie Schmidt with a review on three trending Disney Plus shows. Disney Plus is a streaming app that has almost every single Disney movie you can imagine. It costs $6.99 per month, but in my opinion, it is worth it. I'm going to be rating a few movies, including Clouds, Mulan, and Soul. Clouds is a heartfelt and emotional movie about a high schooler that fights through cancer and makes the best out of his last months. What Zach Sobia focuses most about is making people happy and living his life to the fullest. I would rate this movie a solid 10 out of 10. I felt very moved by how Zach handled the news of his cancer and how he never gave up because of it. The second newest movie is called Mulan in 2020. It is a live adaptation of the 1998 animated film. The movie is about a young woman disguising herself as a man to fight in the battle to save her father. This American film contains action, drama, and adventure as you follow Mulan through her crazy adventures. I would rate this definitely an 8 out of 10 because I thought the live adaptation was very entertaining and a new way to view the film. Even though some things in the storyline change, overall the music was great. Last but not least, one of the newest films, Soul, which came out in December 25th of 2020. It is an animated film where you journey the streets of New York to the cosmetic realms to discover the answers of life's most important questions. The American animated film, which ranks at 96 Rotten Tomatoes, contains drama, comedy, and fantasy. I would definitely recommend this film and rate it a 10 out of 10 for the balance of comedy to life lessons kids will learn from this. Thanks, Valerie. That's all we have time for today. Signing off from Studio 4158, I'm Parker Ryan. You miss a day, you miss a lot.